Hey everyone, Liz here with Stalls, and you are going to want to stick around for this video because I'm going to show you the best heat transfers to use for your sweatshirts. So as cooler temperatures are starting to approach, decorators are going to want to look for high-end, good quality products. So stick around and let's get started. Before we head on over to the heat press, I am going to explain the four products to elevate the look of your sweatshirt. A lot of decorators are looking for a unique finish or even a retro look. So the first heat transfer vinyl is called Soft Foam. This is going to elevate the sweatshirt by offering a textured look, more of a domed finish and a raised effect. Sport Stitch is another product we're going to be using. There is no stitching involved. We're going to heat apply it with only using a heat press. This is going to give you that retro look and also an embroidered edge to give it the look of embroidery. For my next one, this is called Texture Twill. This product is amazing because it offers the texture and the look of twill, again, only applied using your heat press. And then the final product that we will press is our Ultra Color Max DTF from Stalls. This is going to be a low cost, on demand item because it has a quick turnaround time. It has a buttery soft feel to it. So let's go ahead and get started. Come with me to my heat press and we will demo all of these products. For the soft foam heat transfer vinyl, I am going to be using a denim blue cropped boxy uh, crew neck sweatshirt. We are using the Hotronic 16 by 20 heat press. And I went ahead and swapped out the 16 by 20 platen for the 11 by 15. So it's the perfect size for my heat transfer. First thing we're gonna do is thread our sweatshirt. Now soft foam is applied at 300 degrees for 15 second dwell time and your pressure is going to be light. So you're gonna to wanna to aim for a four for your pressure. And first things first, let's pre-press our garment to remove moistures and wrinkles. Next, here is our soft foam logo in navy blue. We are going to remove the carrier. And sometimes I like to fold the transfer in half so I can get that center. About three fingers from the neckline. With soft foam, you do want to use a cover sheet. Fifteen second dwell time. Now let's remove our cover sheet. Soft foam is a cold peel, so you want to wait till it's no longer warm to the touch. So let's go ahead and remove our sweatshirt. Now that it's completely cool, no longer warm to the touch, we're going to go ahead and peel a corner and remove our carrier. Now up we have our CAD Prince Texture Twill. And the garment we're going to be using to heat apply is a Champion Ombre Crew Neck Sweatshirt. So as you can see the colors from a light pink onto the dark maroon. And we went ahead and when we created the CAD Prince Texture Twill, we kind of replicated the same coloring, just to give it that tone on tone look. So let's go ahead and thread our crew neck sweatshirt. Very important to keep the collar off of the lower platen so we create even pressure. CAD Prints Texture Twill is applied at 300 degrees 
for 20 seconds and your pressure is going to be medium at a six. So let's go ahead and pre-press our Garmin. Grab your cover sheet. All right, let's remove our cover sheet and see the final look. Next, we have Sport Stitch from Stalls. And the hooded sweatshirt we are using is from J America in navy. So it's got great detail with the lace up at the neck. So what I did, I switched to the 11 by 15 for this heat application so that this area can be hanging off when I thread my hoodie. Just for that even pressure, laces are hanging off the edge. Sport stitch is applied at 300 degrees, medium pressure, and 20 second dwell time. First, let's pre-press our garment, remove moisture and wrinkles. And for our full color option, we are using Stahl's DTF Ultra Color Max. And for our apparel is a gray crew neck sweatshirt from Hanes. Thread our sweatshirt. And pre-press to remove moisture and wrinkles. Let's grab our transfer. Ultra Color Max is applied at 290 degrees for 15 seconds at a medium pressure and this is a hot peel product. Now let's go ahead and do a brief recap of the sweatshirts that we demoed earlier. First up, we have our Stalls Soft Foam. Again, if you're looking for a product that's going to add texture, that's going to have a raised effect, that retail look, Soft Foam is going to be an excellent choice for your sweatshirts. Next up, if you are looking for that twill option, the Cad Prince Texture Twill was the one I applied on this crew neck shirt. For your no sew option, but you're still looking for that vintage embroidered look, Sport Stitch is what we used on this navy hoodie. It's got that retro look, only heat applied, no sewing involved, so it definitely will elevate those looks for your customers. And finally, for your full color option, Stahl's Direct-to-Film Transfer Ultra Color Max is going to be your go-to for your customers because it not only has that buttery soft feel to it, there's no minimums and it's great for those last minute jobs with the quick turnaround times. Thank you for watching this video and you like what you've seen? Click the links below on our products for more information. I'm Liz with Stalls and don't forget to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more tips, tricks, and heat pressing advice. And I will see you next time.